So, ladies and gentlemen, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something that we've covered at uh, the beginning of the year. Uh, we talked about evaluating functions. And basically, ladies and gentlemen, if we have a function, um, uh, oftentimes we want to find the value of the function at certain intervals. So in this example, our function is the absolute value of 3x minus 1 plus 2. And I want to find the value of my function at the interval of negative 3. So if you guys remember what we did at the beginning of class, all I'm simply going to do is enter in negative 3 in for x, my input value. Right? Yes? Somewhat familiar? So therefore, this would be 3. I'll make sure I use parentheses. So basically what we're doing, which we're going to be using over and over, is we're plugging in our value. Whatever value is our input, we're plugging that into our equation. Then we do negative, uh, negative 3 times 3, which is negative 9. Minus 1 is negative 10. The absolute value of negative 10 is positive 10. Positive 10 plus 2 is equal to 12. That means our function at the value of negative 3 is equal to 12. OK? <coughs> Absolute value of negative 10 is positive 10. Oh, 